Hey everyone, Keith Adams here with another fact video. And um, this video is going to be taken, I'm going to be um, explaining this video or at least the listing the things that I'm going to be going over while I'm taking a ride in my car to kind of promote my website at the same time about vehicles. So um, yeah, I don't have any fancy camera or pod or anything yet. So I'm going to be holding this camera with one hand while driving at the same time. Don't worry, I'm really good at driving. I got paid to do it for about a year. And uh, this route that I'm going on, I've known ever since I started driving. So, um, yeah, without further ado, let's get going. And as I'm driving this car, this brings to mind my second thing on my list this object and that is actually this car right now, the Allbart 500 from Fiat. The Allbart 500 is Fiat's flagship in terms of performance. This vehicle has been tuned to produce over 160 horsepower and 170 foot-pounds of torque out of just a 1.4 liter turbocharged intercooled single overhead cam engine. This combination of power combined with its relatively light weight of 2,500 pounds and a sport tuned suspension and larger disc brakes allowed the Aubar to go around corners at such a pace that the normal 500 cannot, which separates itself from the Fiat lineup in terms of performance. The car also has a straight pipe exhaust system. Fiat and Aubart worked together to try to design an exhaust system that sounded good with a muffler, but they just couldn't get the right tone that they wanted. So eventually they just said, heck with it, we'll get rid of it. They just got rid of the, the muffler and kept the emission stuff on there, and then voila, that is the exhaust that's on the Aubart. It gives it a real distinct sound that is really recognizable in the car community. All right, I'm just driving along right now with my car in sport mode and with these 500 Aubarts. The, uh, the mode actually adds about 7-ish horsepower to the engine and adjusts the throttle response to make it a lot more responsive. So if they take it out of a track, you want that throttle response better. And it also um, adjusts the transmission shift points to make it a lot better. Asus Zenfone Zoom is the flagship of the Asus phones. It is the world's thinnest three times optical zoom phone. The Android 5.0 Lollipop operating system combined with an 8 core 64 bit Snapdragon 615 processor allows for a brilliant 1920 by 1080 with 401 ppi pixel density display. The phone features a 5 megapixel front camera and a 13 megapixel rear camera with three times optical zoom. This is Asus's outstanding attempt at a truly camera based smartphone. Alright, as I'm driving along here, I see a bunch of clouds in the sky, and that leads me to my next topic that the facts are going to be about, and that is the Ace. Not the card, but the Ace Pilot. The Ace Pilot, or Flying Ace, is any pilot credited with shooting down several aircraft throughout their career. There is no set number of how many kills a pilot needs to be considered an Ace. The number varies widely, but is usually around five confirmed victories. The most famous of the Ace Pilots is the Red Baron. He is not the most deadly, but the most famous. The total number of victories for the Red Baron is unconfirmed. Guesses are usually around 80 victories. Alright, continuing to drive along here, I was just informed that I was saying the name of the fish wrong that I chose, so I said Arapaima, I guess it's actually Arapaima, and uh, yeah, but still I'm going to be going over some facts about the Arapaima fish. The Arapaima, native to the Amazon, though also found in Suriname, Africa, they can be seen breaking through the water surface to breathe air. The parents are fiercely protective of their young, and there have been reports of the fish ramming into the fishermen's, leading to the fishermen's deaths. The arapaima can grow up to 9 feet in length and weigh up to 440 pounds, making these giants the 11th largest freshwater fish in the world. 
And that, everyone, concludes um, my facts for this video. And I just want to give a special shout out to my friend Stephen for and thank him for letting me use his camera. And also to my fiance Stephanie for helping me gather some info to produce this video. I also want to give another special shout out to YouTube and to Google and to all those who have liked and subscribed to my videos so far. Uh, thank you all so much. You guys make this even more possible, motivates me even more. And I also want to lead you all to my website. Uh, the website is adamsautoindustries.com. And uh, yeah, have a good day. Thank you. And check out also the links in the description below to the websites which I have found some of this information from.